to my channel. Today I'm going to be talking about my experience with my wedding dress shopping. Okay, so I'm gonna be honest with you guys. When I decided to go wedding dress shopping, it was kind of out of the blue. I was like, hmm, I kind of need to go do this. And so I just scheduled an appointment at David's Bridal, which is one of a known um, wedding dress shop place and I just scheduled it and then I invited a bunch of my bridesmaids and my mom and we just all kind of went and pretty much everybody was able to make it that I invited and yeah so when we arrived they were basically like okay here's all the dress options pick the ones that you like and then we'll choose them in your size so I go ahead and I look through and all of my friends kind of are looking through and my mom and everything and uh, so what you do is like you turn them out so that they can see them and then they pick some options for you. Hi everybody, we're here at David's Bridal. I have some of my bridesmaids and my maid of honor who's behind the camera. And <laughs> and we're looking at dresses. I picked out a couple to try on and uh, we'll see which one looks good. <laughs> So she's like, oh. oh I took a step oh. back. Well, you could be in it, obviously. Oh. I was thinking. And then number two was very Cinderella-y, which was cute, but it's not quite the vibe I was going for. And I really liked the top and it was like kind of poofy, but I don't know. I, it just wasn't quite my uh, cup of tea there. And then the next one, yeah, sleeves just... <laughs> They just weren't my thing. I really think they're pretty and on some styles they are, but I don't know, this one just, the sleeves just didn't work for me and I just didn't like that. The fourth one, so this one was in the running for a very long time. I really loved it. It was just gorgeous and um, a downside to it, it was very expensive for the budget that I was trying to keep. So it was like, I think maybe a thousand three hundred or two hundred or something like that and so to me I was like this is very beautiful but I also tried to like move in it and it was very difficult so that's why I didn't end up choosing it was for the price and the ability to move around and everything like that and then number five was the kind of mermaid I think they call it a line or something like that um, I just felt like it was too form-fitting and then kind of flared out and I just didn't love that look um, I think it's really pretty to show off my curves and stuff, but um, I'm a little more modest And so I just didn't want something that was so like showy in that way So we went with 
we went without that one. <laughs> and then number six, my mom wanted me to try on something short. And while I did kind of like it, I just felt like it didn't represent a wedding. So I just didn't go with that one. And then number seven, oh my gosh. Everybody said when I came out in this dress, I just had like the biggest, happiest smile on and it was so beautiful. And the minute she told me that it was $400 from the clearance rack, I was like, I'm taking it. Like <laughs> This is the one. Um, I just loved that it was like flowy. It had the cute top. I even said um, <laughs> in that moment, it was like, this reminds me of a dress that I used to have that I absolutely loved and then I kind of grew up and I'm too big for it now so I'm not able to wear it and I really love my dress because and this is the dress that I chose um, but it's very summery and flowy and it's not quite what I pictured myself in but it's what I ended up really loving and I feel like that's part of doing this experience is that you think or you have something in mind and then you get there and it's all changed and different once you have things on yourself and you see how that looks. But yeah, this was the one. I loved the price, I loved the flowy, and I loved that I could move. I didn't feel restricted, I felt great. I could do squats, I could move around, and it just feels really, really good, and I love it so much. Ah. So that's the one I ended up going with, and I'm super happy. So I hope you guys enjoyed seeing my wedding dress shopping experience and I'll see you next time. Bye! There are going to be buttons in the dress okay. that help them button it, but they are, you have to, they're going to have to learn how to bustle. Because okay. I, my friend just got married and I had to bustle it and it was really hard and I had to practice. Ah. So. It's not working, just zip it up. <laughs> have a good friend, Carrie. Literally. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> done this plenty oh, of time.
breaks my leg. <laughs> if it's something that you think you can live with. Oh, 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 oh my god. <laughs> okay. Your name is Brad and we have a, like a sin. And you make a wish on the spell. So you hold the bell and then you make a wish for you and your fiance on your wedding day. And after you ring it, we celebrate with you. Are you picture first? Okay. Um, so I gotta make my wish? Yeah. And then you gotta ring it.